Security, as I promised in the beginning, uh, for you to give President Trump a grade on his G20 appearances and performances and meetings. I think it was a very successful trip for the for the president for the United States. I mean, uh, given the fact that they came out of the meeting with Putin with a commitment to uh, continue to fight ISIS together and to try to put in no-fly zones and ceasefires, it tends to indicate to me that the president showed Putin that he can't be manipulated by him and he's a tough guy. I think it's really good that he showed concerning trade that America first does not equal America alone, that there's plenty of opportunity to to deal with countries that have excessively low currencies and trade surpluses versus countries like ours that has an excessive trade deficit uh, and have freer trade. And I think that the fact that the Europeans admitted that showed that the president achieved some real tangible success. And, and then lastly, I want to thank him for hanging tough on the Paris Accord. You know, I don't care how many Europeans say that they want to uh, do the Paris Accord, wreck their economy, just to subsidize China, India, Russia, and, and some African countries. That's their business. We have, we have the United States of America to protect, which is the essence of foreign policy, protect our national interest. Well, that's a doozy, but I have to go. I just got, as you're wrapping it, telling me your last uh, statement, I just got, got to wrap, so I have to go, so I have to leave it there. Uh, Congressman uh, Francis Rooney, I appreciate your time, and maybe we'll come back and talk about your last statement some other time. Thanks for having me on. Thank you.